Hello. <laughs> What's your color? So I wanna know. I wanna know. I could be red, or I could be yellow. I could be blue, or I could be purple. I could be green or pink or black or white. I could be every color you like. I could be red, or I could be yellow, I could be blue, or I could be purple, I could be green or pink or black or white, I could be every color you like. For today's book, we have Arthur's Birthday by Mac Brown, also one of an Arthur Adventure series. Because it's Arthur's birthday, I chose Happy Birthday Filter, and uh, to talk about the storyline, I'll just turn off the filter for now. It's me again. So, to talk about the storyline of Arthur's Birthday book, um, it is Arthur's birthday, and um, Arthur plans to make a birthday party with all of his classmates, including boys and girls. So Arthur plans to do a really huge birthday party with all of his relatives and his classmates, and he also invites, uh, he also has his grandmother to cake a huge um, chocolate cake for the whole class, whole class. and. Um, Arthur gives invitations for all of his classmates, and then Arthur meets Muffy, who is a girl in one of a girl in his class. And Muffy also gives him an invitation for his birthday. And Arthur thinks it will be another date, which would um, which would be Mar Muffy's birthday. But actually, it is the same date when the birthday party actually happens. And they both have their birthday in uh, this Saturday afternoon, and Muffy can't change the date because Muffy has rock bands and pickles. The clown have been booked for months, and then Arthur has um, all of my, all of his relatives come from Onyo, which is very far, far away. So, um. Uh, Arthur's classmates has to choose which party they're going to go, Muffy's or Arthur's. And the boys, because Arthur is a boy, the boys stood in Arthur's part, and then the girls who stood in Muffy's part, um, they both think, why do we need girls? Why do we need boys to enjoy the party? And then Francine, Francine thinks differently, and Arthur thinks differently too. So Francine and Arthur, Ar Arthur meets, and then they discuss about what they should do to change this problem. And then Arthur has an ama amazing idea, which changes all of the thing, the, all of the problems that is going to happen. He r writes a letter to Muffy, and then secretly gives it to M Muffy w during during the weekends. And then the the letter holds the problem solving thing and if you want to find out how Arthur solves this problem you can check out this book in the library this is this is a really good book for start start readers and it is really fun and it also has many kinds of vocab and English skills that you can learn from it as well this is sometimes going to happen in our daily lives as well so you can get some ideas of what you should act to when when you have this problem on facing you so um this is an amazing book and if you want to um look at more of arthur's book then you can go to an arthur um, um an arthur adventure series and check out more books about something like this okay bye bye